Don't we all want a dirty grandpa so we can say dick jokes and cuss? Uh, right before uh, his wedding, a lawyer is tricked to go to Bear of Florida for spring break with his grandfather. Um, played by Zach Efron and uh, Robert De Niro. Uh, Zach Efron be the lawyer and Robert De Niro be the, the dirty grandpa. Uh, what I liked about this film was uh, Robert De Niro. I uh, thought he was having a blast play, uh, playing this character. He thought he was having fun. He wasn't floated in like some characters at his age like Bruce Willis and Slasher Sloan, they like bowled in all their work, I feel like. Um, I also like how funny it was. It was actually like really funny. <laughs> I laughed kind of a kind of a lot. And it's kind of surprising for a January film, so I would say this is probably my favorite movie this month. Uh, I liked Zach Efron's character, he was pretty like I thought he'd be more of an uptight asshole, but uh, as the film went on, I actually liked his character too. I thought he was pretty crazy, pretty funny. He was still uptight, but um, he kind of let loose. So I, it was pretty cool to see a different side of Zac Efron. Uh, he also, it was also a part of this film that actually brought me back to his high school musical days. So it was pretty funny. I was like, oh my goodness, he put the same, like, High school musical song or something that's what I felt like so it was I liked this character a lot. Uh, what I did not like was this drug dealer. Um, I don't know who the actor's name, but I've been seeing him a lot lately. I just don't like that actor. He's uh he plays Ralphie in the league, which is a good show by the way. Um, I just don't like that guy. He was just too crazy, too uptight. Not uptight, but just ah, too crazy. I don't like that. He was just. Every time he was on stage, I was like, you know, just get him off. So, um, I also thought the movie was a little too long. Uh, I mean, the movie was only an hour and 45 minutes, but it felt like it was two hours for some reason. So, uh, I, I wasn't bored. I was just like, wow, this movie, I think it's kind of long. Overall, I would say this is a good film. I would, uh, I think it's a good film you go to see it with your boyfriend, girlfriend, or with some friends in the theater or you just have a good time. Uh, so I'm going to give this movie a 3.5 out of 5. So, uh, can't wait to see what these, I want to see a sequel to this film.